I'm Travis Guillory. Here are your top stories from Two Works for You. The OSBI is now looking into allegations against former OU President David Boren. This week, an article from the website Nondoc alleges sexual battery by Boren and a former administrator, Trip Hall, from 2010 to 2012 against an OU graduate. Boren's lawyer denies those allegations. Bags are being checked this morning in Porham after a bomb threat inside of a school building. Investigators say they searched the campus yesterday but didn't find anything out of place. Now detectives are trying to find out who's responsible for that threat. Crews are pushing forward to replace a pedestrian bridge just north of downtown. Tomorrow, crews will install the bridge on Martin Luther King Jr. Boulevard between Jasper and Latimer Streets. King between Jasper and Latimer will be closed on Saturday. Let's get a check of our Friday forecast for meteorologist Clint Boone. Okay, thank you very much, Travis. Don't forget that umbrella heading out the door. We're going to have some scattered showers and storms this morning. A few of these largely severe with some hail possible. A break this afternoon. One last warm day with temperatures near 70. More storm chances tonight as a cold front moves in and turns much cooler for the weekend. 50 tomorrow, 55 Sunday after some frost in the morning. Cool for Monday and then temperatures warm back up by next Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday. All right, thanks, Clint, and thank you for tuning in to this digital news update. Keep checking back for updates throughout the day. I'm Travis Guillory, Two Works for You.